Okay, next we're going to start the cutting. Taking a half inch section, you're going to make your initial cut, and this is going to start the basis of your guide that's going to go along the entire haircut. Taking a half inch of hair, possibly a little more, and working your way right around, following your guide from the previous cut. Okay, so, and we're just going to continue around. And remember what I said about keeping the hair towards the face. You want to keep following that. And we're going to tilt the client's head down so we can get that neck, the neckline. And you can see he's got a nice lovely colic there that wants to pop that hair out. And we're just going to leave it a little heavier there, which is why we don't cut towards the contour. And we're going to comb that hair forward. And starting with your first section on the right side here, you're going to grab that over direct from the bangs, grabbing a little bit from the side so you have a guide to follow, and letting that just that guide just fall out just slightly. And you're going to go through, and you're going to take that little bit of hair off, and you're actually texturizing and taking length at the same time, completely cutting out a whole step. Using your traveling guide and working your way right around the head, you're just picking up anything that's overlapping from the top. So you're taking a little bit from the top and a little bit from the sides and taking anything off that doesn't belong. Okay, so now it's time for the fringe area. Now, when you're doing the bangs, depending on the direction that the hair goes, and with Tommy here, it goes from right to left, you're going to stand in the direction that the hair flows so that you can turn the client's head, see where your guide left off here, and you're going to follow that around, and you're going to just go with the motion here. Never pull bangs too tight. Never keep that tension too tight. Bangs have a tendency to shrink when they dry, so you always want that little bit of room. And with this cut in particular, the bangs are normally on the longer side compared to the you know, rest of the haircut.